Well, hello there. Welcome back to my channel. It is, of course, Chelsea of She Designs Things. And in today's short video, I'm actually going to be sharing you with you guys a project that I'm working on. Um, this project I created in honor of my sister. And the whole reason I wanted to do this was I was already thinking about a way to share some of my code, some of my expertise and my knowledge, but I decided to kind of make it twofold. Um, my sister was a really giving person and she would, <laughs> she was a goof, but she would give you her, her absolute last, um, no questions asked. So for that reason, I decided that instead of me adding the codes and HTML that I use to my own site, I would create a project site. And so I created this project site in honor of her. So you can go to sierraproject.org, which her name is spelled S-I-E-A-R-A. <laughs> My mom was really fancy with the spelling of our names. So except for mine, I got, I got, I got, I just got chelts. <laughs> but anyways, um, I think my sister would love this because she was a very sociable person and in the spirit of giving i wanted to do something to help small business owners people who are hunting or searching for these codes but also i do want to expand upon this project eventually because one of the things that i had to do for my sister when she passed away was do designs and so i eventually want to add a designing portion of it where designers like myself and others will help you know families create their obituaries and their programs if they're going to do like a traditional funeral um because i had to do those things and i know it can be really difficult for families i'm just realistic about <laughs> the imminent demise of us all so it was not difficult for me to do i was honored to be able to do that for my sister um, yeah, it's one of the things where we honor our dead. <laughs> so I would love to add something like that to this site, <clears throat> but I just want to give you guys a quick view of it. So this is the, technically this is the homepage where you can learn more about my sister, um, and kind of read her story. And if you have a story and you want to share your story, just hit the contact us and that will take you over to the contact page. I think I actually broke the contact page since I deleted the original one, but we're going to talk about that. But if you go to the codes page, you're going to be able to find the codes right now for the sign up using Google Sheets and HTML. So that's there. And then the code is located towards the bottom and all you'll have to do is copy it like this. Copy. And so, yeah, you'll do that. Going down, I do have the product card and then I also have the product card with the PayPal add to cart button. Um, and I do show you where you would change the value. So this is the only value you'll have to change as far as getting your button to work to add to cart. Uh, and then you will need to put your image here and I'll add more resources <clears throat> to where you can host your your images for your products. And then there's that code and of course the coveted social media icons. And if you want to add more icons to these social media icons or if there's something that you don't use, it's very easy. Just go on and highlight you know, this line here when you have it in your editor and then delete it. And then to add something else like a dribble or something, I don't know, anything else that you may use, you just have to change the fa. <laughs> so all of these are using font awesome. So FA space FA dash and then whatever the brand is. So specifically brands use a different type of tag. So this one is the fa fa dash Facebook or whatever you're going to use. All right. So as I develop and create more HTML based codes for you guys to use, um, I'll be adding them to the top. I don't want people to have to scroll all the way down to the bottom every time they need to, you know, get something. So the new things <coughs> will always appear towards the top of this page. And then of course I have a landing page layout for someone who is like having difficulty setting up their website or web page so i created this landing page layout to kind of help you understand the flow of 
your website, um, what it should look like if you're using like a typical landing page. And then there's also the get help area where if you or someone you know is struggling um, with alcohol misuse or, you know, mental health issues, you can go on over to that page. And then if you would like to also, you know, support this page here by giving your codes, your expertise, just also go ahead and use the contact page to be able to send that information. I did have to wait for it to load up because I just changed it, but there you have it. So you'll be able to put in your name, your email, and whatever message you want to send, and then it'll send to me. Now for this, I am using Formaloo, and I'll make a separate video about that at a different time, but I did want to just make this video really short and really quick to show you that this is something if you're interested in any of the codes that I use on my Google site tutorials or videos, this is where you'll go to get access to those codes. So just head on over to the Sierra project. It's not the actually, it's just sierraproject.org. <laughs> so you just go to here and then .org. All right, thanks so much for watching. And of course, laters.